Well, tonight, a follow-up to an I-Team investigation into the state's plan to put metered parking on Revere Beach. Residents and homeowners say that they knew nothing about the plan until the meters began going in. The I-Team started asking questions, and now the state is backing down. WBZ Chief Investigator Cheryl Fiendaka broke this story and has the latest from Revere. There will be no metered parking for residents along Revere Beach after two I-Team investigations into the lack of outreach and the impact to the community, the state pulled back its plans. Getting rid of meters on the, on the left-hand side, having uh, additional resident-only parking. The mayor of Revere says the residential part of the beach and all of Ocean Avenue will now be resident parking only. There will be no meters from Revere Street up north to, to the Point of Pines. We also made sure and, and really fought for resident parking on Ocean Ave. Uh, that would be 24-7 resident parking on Ocean Ave. Welcome, everybody. The Department of Conservation and Recreation held virtual meetings on the proposal for metered parking in the middle of the pandemic. Residents told us this week they knew nothing about the program and had no input. But Revere's mayor did know and supported it. Uh, Revere can support and will support a plan for parking meters. Why would you support it? It's not a bad policy. Ultimately, any policy has to take into account residents. And the initial plan from DCR did not do that and mitigate any of the challenges that they may have. The I-Team also questioned DCR about using dumpsters instead of trash pails at the beach. After our story aired, DCR agreed to remove them. The mayor's wife posted our tweet on Facebook with a thank you. Having uh, the pressure put on the state by residents really helped. Anyone with a car registered in Revere is entitled to a free resident parking permit. DCR will still have meters on the beach for non-residents. Cheryl Fiandaka, WBZ News. What